Here's how you hack the skin for acne holistically. When follicles become clogged with oil or dead skin, you start getting blackheads, pimples, acne, all that type of stuff. That's the basic definition of it. Now let's move on to these skin hacks. Number one, tea tree oil. You want to dilute it with some water and apply it to the affected areas on the face. Tea tree oil has known to be significantly antibacterial for the body. Number two is aloe vera. Now the hack to this is making sure that it's fresh. You can get it from any organic food store or grow some yourself. They're really easy to grow and they grow in the harshest of conditions, but you can get it fresh and apply it to the prone areas of the skin where you get acne. Aloe vera is very soothing and anti-inflammatory. Last but not least is calendula. It's best to use this in infused creams or ointments due to its properties. Antimicrobial, anti-inflammatory, great for healing too. Even outside of acne, it's great for healing like burns and things of that nature. And shout out to Body Love by Tao. She has an amazing Calendula product line. Y'all should go check her out. As a matter of fact, I already tagged her. But wait, there's more. Here's a few dietary guidelines for acne because believe it or not, it all starts in the gut. There's these things called high glycemic index foods, sugary snacks, refined grains, processed foods. This sucks for your stomach. It barely knows what to do with it and it just goes into survival mode. Next is dairy products. It worsens the skin. It literally makes everything worse. Either lower it or eliminate it. Me personally, I say eliminate it out of your diet. Now, last but not least, here's my personal remedy that I use on my face every day. Because as y'all can see, your boy shining in his own destiny. Hashtag no filter. I literally just do warm, like really, really warm, borderline hot, like scalding hot, towel compressions on my face. And before I even give my face time to really dry off, I get some shea butter. I smooth it down real, real, real smooth. And then I just along my face. Then I have a personal oil that I made myself that I've been using for years that I apply to my facial hair, things of that nature, and I actually need to shave. But I can keep talking. I'm not going to bore y'all. Y'all hit that follow button and stay tuned for more content. Oh, and ask something in the comments section. I'm answering questions.